Area clearance. Area clearance is to mill in area in the material. There are two types of milling, raster and offset. Select your text or object. Go to toolpath. Area clearance. Select your tool. Diameter 3, height 22. Select your machining strategy. Raster will mill the material on an angle. An offset can be used for high speed machining. Select raster. Leap angle at 0. Sequence will decide which way the machining will be done first. It will do the X first, Y first, or near first. Near first is the most efficient way of machining. Ramp. While doing area clearance, the most common tool will be mill cutters. And mill cutters are too fragile to cut if you cut into the material at a right angle. With the ramp function, the cutter breaks can be prevented because the tool goes into the material at an angle. You can leave it at default 6 degrees. Now, set the total depth to 2. Side allowance is the area outside the toolpath. Precision cutting can be achieved by setting a side allowance. You can leave it at zero for this. Overlap ratio is the ratio of the width of the tool's bottom blade to the width last toolpath. The reason you need to set an overlap ratio is that you might need to take the width of the tool into consideration during machining. If the overlap ratio is too low, then some parts of the material will not be machined. If you keep the space between the toolpaths as close as possible, then the surface of the material after machining will be smooth. However, if the overlap ratio is too high, then the machining efficiency will be reduced as well. So set overlap ratio to 35. As we're only doing one layer, you don't need multi-layer machining. And mill contour, select anti-clockwise. Click OK. And the toolpath will be formed. To simulate the toolpath, go to toolpath toolpath shaded simulation. Make sure it's on ISO view so it looks like this. You can set the simulation speed and click start. Now, to save the toolpath, go to Toolpath, Toolpath Output, save it under General CNC, and once you saved it, the toolpath for area clearance has been created. That is all for this tutorial.